Okay, here's a new, um, here's how to uh, subscribe to our podcast on the iPhone. Um, so there's Joey in the background there. Um, so I already have the app installed, but we'll pretend like I don't. And we'll go to the App Store right next to the contacts there. Okay, and the way, obviously, just like on iTunes, the way I like to search is by typing Clive Barker. Thanks for suggesting Clive Berger. Okay, here we go. So there it is. So uh, for me, it says open already, but for you, it will it will say get because it's free. So you just click on get and it'll download the app and then you'll have all of the, the apps there in your... Um, you'll have all of the episodes there in your in your app. And actually, I'm going to open it up so you can see what it looks like. So as we're recording this, episode 144 is our most recent one. I haven't finished editing 145 yet. Um, so this has, you can do all and it'll show all the episodes or audio, which is still mostly all the episodes. There's also a video section. Uh, this video, if I can fit it in there, I will do my best, but we only have 400 uh, megabytes of upload per month on our service so i don't know if i can if i can fit a video in there and still have room for podcasts so i might you know see what i can do there but um yeah so i like this app um you can also if you click on the little hamburger in the upper left corner there you can see like you can contact us set an alarm uh you can do settings you can tell it to auto download or you can just stream them uh, you can download them individually if you want to. So I'm pretty happy with this, with the way this app turned out. And I believe it's slightly different, but we'll see. Uh, Jose's going to make a recording of the, of the uh, Android app as well. So you don't have to just hear about the iPhone. Okay, so uh, next we are going to subscribe to the podcast. So there are lots of different podcatcher apps, but the, you know... For just for the purpose of this, um, everybody has this one that Apple provides with iOS. It's called Podcasts, and I've got mine down in the lower right corner because I love podcasts, so I like to keep it close by all the time. So you click on Podcasts, and I've already been listening to one of my own podcasts. Yeah, don't judge me. Okay, so if we go to Podcasts and then you go to Search... You can search, um, I, again, search for Clive Barker and see what you come up with on the store. So, uh, wow. Okay, so when I was in iTunes earlier on the desktop, it put us before the Nerdist. The Nerdist had one, ep actually two episodes with Clive Barker. Um, but they're a way more popular, obviously, uh, podcast than us. So then you just, you'll find the Clive Barker podcast there with my name underneath. You just tap on that and then you can find it there and you can say, it, it'll say subscribe on yours. It won't say unsubscribe. Please don't click on subscribe. Okay. <laughs> so, so you got subscribe up there. You can tap on subscribe or you can just download an episode if you just want to listen to one and test it out. And, uh, of course, here, if you tap on reviews in the middle there, uh, you can see the reviews. I don't think on the phone that you can write a review. I think you have to do that on, like, iTunes on the computer, which is a little bit annoying. I think they should let you write reviews. Uh, so, yeah, anyway. Um, or, actually, maybe you can. I think if you tap on... Oh, yeah, you tap on write review. It says right down there under ratings and review. You can do write review. Uh, write a, a review for us. That really will help us out too. Okay. So there, I think we've looked at everything on the Apple side that can be done. Uh, let us know if you have any questions.